And a new warning from health officials tonight. They're seeing a growing number of coronavirus cases linked to funerals. KSNT News reporter Lindley Lunn explains how local funeral homes are keeping grieving families safe. The Shawnee County Health Department is seeing 41 cases of coronavirus, including one death directly linked to funeral services. However, one local funeral home is saying that the families they have worked with have been complying with the restrictions. Social distancing, masks, and no more than 10 people are what funeral services look like during a pandemic, and especially at the Chapel Oaks Cremation and Funeral Services in Topeka. You just have to be vigilant in practicing this social distancing and wearing your masks and the sanitizer. We've got it all over the funeral home. Local funeral directors say many families have been cooperating with these restrictions, but they aren't always happy about it. Your first instinct is to hug your loved ones and to be together. So um, it is a difficult time to be a funeral director during a pandemic. Susan Hutton with Chapel Oaks tries to encourage families to use these restrictions as much as possible, but some do not want to wear masks or hold private ceremonies at their own homes. This caused Shawnee County Health Officer Gianfranco Pizzino to bring awareness to the problem. The last thing you want to do is to end up 10, 15 days after the service knowing that some of the people who came to your service fell sick with a potentially serious disease and maybe even uh, died as a result of that. And Hutton says many families who have not wanted to comply with the restrictions have actually rescheduled their funeral service for September. Reporting in Topeka, Lindley Lund, KSNT News.